Hi, today is Friday and uh, I look better because of the light condition is better. I have one thing to say that I hate this camera. Why? Because it is going to be quite um, old, this laptop. Uh, I have used it for two years but with the time I use it sometimes I just ran the lap I just use the laptop for 24 hours or 48 hours without turning off and so it causes that um, the camera when I close or when I move the lid of the camera this one it will lose the connection and I cannot do anything to fix it except restart the computer again then the camera will work and yes it is very frustrating because for example just now when I close it or when I change the lid to have a, another view of the camera it will lose the, co uh, the connection that is very bad second thing here it is quite um, noisy right now because I'm sitting at my first floor of the house I'm living in the second floor so when a motorbike runs through it will make noise and I'm already watching TV which is um, I cannot read it um, Australian MasterChef uh, but for kids uh, I'm not sure the name because it is uh, blocked somehow and yes I love cooking but I don't cook much because I'm lazy and that is very embarrassing okay the first thing I want to say is um, to, where is it where is my papers today I just come to the hospital and do some examinations first is I did a x-ray photo of my lung and my heart there is a horn of the bike outside um, and uh, yes I don't need to wear glasses to to watch this because I can see good in in um, short, uh, short distance um, yes about the lung I'm okay my heart are okay my lung are okay my heart is okay, my lungs are okay, I have two lungs, right? And uh, the same thing of me is that um, when you do an x-ray, there's two lungs and a heart. I thought the heart was up here. <laughs> it is under this, so uh, there was a part missing of the lung. It, it doesn't make two, two lungs, which is, um, which is um, as big as each other. So I thought there's something happening with my lung, but it turns out it was the place of the heart. So the heart is under here. Now I know this. Before I didn't. So that is because I did never pay paid attention about my my health, and that is what I have to change. Um, about the blood uh, test, it is totally okay. Uh, I just only have something in my lung that makes me often cough and. Um, cough a lot uh, when the weather changed and that is what uh, it's, it is a, not to this symptom and this uh, illness is not to be worried about um, about uh, why I did the test at the hospital because um, I cannot sweat and I have problem with my liver which is it cannot uh, transaction it cannot it cannot do well with all the stuff I consume and the, it left poison in me because it doesn't throw everything out through the to sweat to through the skin and to sweat because I cannot sweat well so it causes me in the eastern way of method I have a hot liver and I had something here, but I don't know. But the doctor said it is normal, it's okay, and um, just cut it to have a surgery. But my my parents don't know, don't want to have the surgery because 
Yeah, in the summer it's very humidity and um, it is very. It is not good to have a surgery operation or something like it, uh, even a small one, because it can cause as many things else. So I'm not doing it. And uh, except I will try to do some yeast method away, which is have something which looks like a pen, but it's not. Is this? But you can see that cannot. You can write with it. It is a uh, hard and it goes like this and like this and all through this and just mm, to to write on your face like this with some rules and then there are points that you stem on it that that it hurts badly than other points and to do it with um, some numbers here there are many numbers of in your face and when you do it it will heal you uh, it's a kind of um, Vietnamese uh, Eastern method of doing it uh, I'm not sure about it so yeah. every day I must go to meet the doctor to do it and I hope it works I will try it for around a week and if it, it does the hurt, oh my god, I'm sleepy again. Any um, uh, result, I will change it. I will. Uh, so, I don't know. Um, got no, nothing special today. What I do the whole day is wake up, skip breakfast, skip almost everything, and go to the hospital to take all the tests, and then go home, and then wait. So as a result, I go to take it again and go home and blah blah blah. Ah oh, yes, a routine day. Tomorrow I must go to work. Oh no, going to work. <laughs> There's one thing. You have, uh, you know, people with with silk. You use when you iron it. You use your cool iron. And yes, cool iron. I I imagine in my head how it is, but. It was my, uh, my, my mistake that I didn't look for this word and when I translated it back into Vietnamese to the housekeeping I said cool iron and then I explained it how cool iron is and she, sh and she said um, there's no cool iron, there's steaming iron because that you steamed <laughs> to, to iron the silk and I was confused because the customers she was very um, careful and she asked me to cool iron it and be careful with it and then after um, discussing with the housekeeping uh, I said, so wow, well, maybe about the iron thing, I'm not sure, I will ask the customer again, but just uh, watch it and then uh, the iron it later. And the mistake here is the customer only need to cool iron it and doesn't need to wash it because washing it makes uh, a silk squeeze, a squeeze together and it is not um, flat, it is it looks mm, will be like this and she is angry with me my mistake because I thought when you iron something it must be clean and when it must be when it is and to be clean it needs to be washed so I stand the t-shirt to wash and yeah the customer gave me the shirt yesterday morning Yesterday night she came back to the hotel and asked about that mistake and I was called by another college. Uh, then yeah he did he solved the problem for me but this morning the customer she complains about it again and I had my today is my day off and uh, my uh, front desk uh, manager office she called me and uh, she told me about everything and then yes the customer she is angry I don't know what I will face tomorrow when I go to work I uh, call
called I called to the hotel to the hotel this morning to ask my um, manager that I would like to speak to her directly through the phone because I cannot go to work to apologize her. But my manager said, no, you don't need to apologize so much because we already we already did it and too many people saying that it's not, it's not good. Okay, you can go. And I don't want to do it because that is my fault and that that, that is my responsibility to to take that is my mission, my responsibility to take the responsibility that about the problem that I made and she doesn't let me do it. So tomorrow morning I need to to meet the customer again. I'm not sure that she is here or not or she leaves. I believe that she will leave tomorrow morning and I just hope that she came down and check out of the hotel not too um, late because, um, because if she checks out too late or if she leaves when there's too crowded I cannot speak to her and that is what I don't like I want to apologize to her and we are doing in the service uh, industry and to have trouble with the guests. I don't like it at all. And well, my manager, the boss, not the person I met, the, the boss, she will have a bad impression of me. And I'm still a trainee. I uh, trainee because the trainee uh, contract is in two months. This is my third month here and I'm looking forward to to sign a good contract but with those problems I'm not sure about anything. Oh no, my life is so freaking Yes, I can't do, I can't be complaining so I will stop now and um, yes I'm sleepy I will that's loud, right? Uh, I will go to sleep now because I need to wake up early in the morning tomorrow because I need to go to sleep. I don't know why I speak too fast, but I'm sleeping. Mm, coffee won't help because I drink coffee too much. That makes me that I that coffee has no um what has no function has nothing to do anymore. Okay. There's no what useful. <laughs> I forgot all the words, so I will stop talking now. And I talk already too much, so bye. Uh, I'm fine. I'm healthy. Um, kind of healthy, but I'm not in a bad illness. So that is uh, tomorrow is what tomorrow is Saturday, right? So. Have a nice weekend. Bye.